This is a manual test of my uh, MPPT uh, DIY charge design. That meter there is the operating potential of the PV module. That right there is charge current. There's the pick microcontroller, a little uh, MC34063 board I built as a 12 volt to 5 volt potential converter for the pick. And the buck converter board. Right now, the only thing to adjust it is this trim pot, which simply adjusts the duty cycle. I'll look at. Yes. And. So right now it is strictly manual. Now that I've got this bit down, I am going to be working on a um, algorithm, taking multiple uh, analog inputs in the form of the uh, potential in the form of the uh, input from a potential divider across the PV input and the PV current from the from the ACS 713 on the board. Um, and the way the algorithm will work is it will take the product of those two measurements, which is of course the PV input power, and doing some mathematics on that, namely comparing it to a previous peak power that has been stored in memory, it will uh, uh, run a, a loop which will keep executing until it finds the peak power or until the uh, power that it's getting from the PV uh, module is no longer uh, greater than the peak in memory and then it will stop executing the loop for a bit and then it will recheck the PV array. It's pretty much a perturb and observe type algorithm which of course works for a PV module because uh, there's no um, any changes you make to the operating potential and its effects on the on the operating current are pretty much instantaneous there isn't the delay associated with the uh, rotational inertia of something like a wind generator which of course also around here are virtually useless because you either have virtually no wind like we've got now or you have to dodge the occasional flying tree and there's pretty much it's one of those two extreme. This is just an old uh, uh, close to dead because um, I've had it for about seven years now. Um, uh, 12 volt 17 ampere hour battery. So 17 ampere or 18 ampere hour, one of the two. Uh, Power Sonic. And a chicken. The chicken is, of course, not part of the test, obviously. See. Feels a bit on the warm side, but that's probably just why to do to all this stuff being in the sun. Though it is moving since it's getting late in the day. It's 4.30 p.m. right now. But it works. For now. The incandescent lamps, that's the same uh, group of four type 313 lamps I had in my uh, testing yesterday. Uh, that is just to see that there is a load because otherwise the uh, operation of the buck converter might be unstable if there isn't a proper load on the end of it or on the output. And that is a 30 watt um, UL solar module I got about three years ago with some uh, Halloween sale. They're running it with 60 bucks, which was dirt cheap at the time. And it comes with a uh, fairly long, about 10 foot or 8 foot cord which is useful for purposes of experimentation. Waiting. Speaking to the cat. Um, yeah. And charge current's down to 1.31 amperes. Stop. Good cat. We're not trying to break. Enough.